Scientists are calling this phenomenon snow blood. Patches of red snow that can be seen gleaming in the sunlight in the French Alps. Locals say it's becoming more and more prominent in early summer. The crimson color is caused by the presence of an algae. The phenomenon is accelerating snowmelt, and scientists say it could be due to climate change. Eric Marichal and his team from Grenoble's Scientific Research National Center are collecting samples of the algae on Le Brevant Mountain. He says the microalgae typically has a green color, but turns red when exposed to strong solar radiation. Uh, lorsque c'est dans la neige, uh, ça accumule un pigment comme une crème solaire, comme uh, pour se protéger de l'intensité lumineuse. Un peu comme nous quand on va faire du ski, ou même là, aujourd'hui, uh, on, on prend des coups de soleil. Et on se met de la crème solaire. Et euh, les algues, pour se protéger, elles se... Enfin, pour se protéger, on pense que c'est pour se protéger, parce qu'on n'en a pas encore la démonstration. Euh, elles accumulent ce pigment rouge qui l'emporte sur le vert. Donc, elles sont fondamentalement vertes, mais c'est caché par un gros bouclier de pigment rouge. The algae was first described by Aristotle in the 3rd century BC, but it was only formally identified and given its Latin name Sanguina nivoloids in 2019. Scientists are now racing to understand it better before it's too late, as rising global temperatures are hitting the Alps disproportionately hard. There is a double reason. The first is the fact that it's a very little explored. And the second reason is that this little explored is falling under our eyes. So we have a kind of urgency. So we have to deploy very quickly the means to collect échantillons. That's what we do today. And then to study the research with all the modern means that exist in biology. Some scientists say the volumes of algae appear to be growing due to climate change, with higher carbon dioxide concentrations in the atmosphere favoring blooms. Alberto Amato is a genetic engineering researcher at CIA Centre de Grenoble. Euh, ce qu'on sait aussi, c'est que euh, euh, au fur et à mesure du temps, du coup, quand le, la, le CO2 a augmenté dans l'atmosphère, on retrouve toujours plus souvent des, algues, des neiges rouges. Euh, du coup, voilà, c'est sûrement lié à, au réchauffement climatique. Et euh, plus ça réchauffe, plus il y a d'algues, plus la neige fond rapidement. Du coup, c'est un peu un cercle vicieux euh, et on cherche à comprendre euh, exactement tous les mécanismes qui produisent ce cercle pour éventuellement euh, faire quelque chose. Research is ongoing, but what is certain is that the presence of the algae accelerates snow melt. That's because the algae's pigment reduces its ability to reflect the sun's heat. If the algae do spread, snow and glacier melt around the world could speed up. <laughs>